squeeze. Seven. Come on. You want to be the real champion? Your mom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're in the game room right now. About to go play some Rainbow Six Siege. Yeah, this is the game room we got going on. It's kind of ghetto. So we got approved for the for the new house. So the house you guys saw in the last video, we got approved in. We're, we're officially moving in March 1st. We'll give you guys a full tour of that. Yeah. The game room is going to be, what do you think? It's like three times, four times as big as this. Four yeah. times as big. Yeah. Easy. So we could have an orgy in there. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to baptize you right now. <laughs> The twins leave tomorrow morning to go to LA, and then yeah. they get back on the first. So I'm gonna go pack up the the crib with Abby, and get ready, and then we'll be going to uh, the other new crib. All right, we're having the blue steel pump early morning workout with uh, Caesar. He's gonna be taking me and the twins to a back and bicep workout. I wanted to introduce um, them to him. He like he might be able to help them because the twins want to compete this year. So I think Caesar could help them with uh, like bodybuilding stuff posing and all that because he's got like cool different I like the way like when you like bodybuilder bodybuilder strain like different techniques and angles different tweaks not always like scientifically optimal but I think that's the better way to train um, through experience and uh, working out people who have been training for years and years doing this stuff so he's gonna take us through a good workout it's early so I'm tired um, let's, let's get into it
<laughs> All right, so we're training shoulders with Caesar again. I'm sure, you guys remember him. He's taking uh, huh? Oh, Chris is out. Uh, I'm training with my nephews. <laughs> Chris is editing, so Chris isn't here. But we got uh, we got Mikey and Kyle. So he's gonna take us through a shoulder workout. Got the Alpha Lion Pump Blue Steel Code Alex, 50 percent off. It's too early. It's not really that early. It's noon, but it's, it's, it's early, early for us. It's almost one o'clock. That's not noon. We just go, we just <laughs> not early. Yeah, we did. Mikey, Mikey, I'm literally taking a shit after like just waking up, and Mikey's like knocking on the door, saying like, "Yo, you trying to go to the gym in 15 minutes?" <laughs> He's like, See, I, I, guess. I was ready. Uh, I was ready this time. I did that. Like, and this is my first time uh, trying this, so we gonna see. Hey, 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 go find out. All right, so I didn't want to bore you guys just with a bunch of workouts, but we've been trying to kind of take our training to the next level. So shout out Caesar for kind of helping us out. He's been uh, doing bodybuilding for a while and coaching a lot of people, and he's just a really good trainer. So uh, luckily, he goes to my high school gym. So this is like literally 10 minutes away from my house. So I uh, figured he'd be, he's been helping us out a little bit with some workouts. So that's really dope. So we train shoulders. I've never just trained shoulders in one day. Um, usually I pair it with like chest or arms or something. So it was this was a ton of volume um, He's kind of got us doing like a little bit of a bro split um, Which is honestly what I had the most amount of growth from so I know a lot of people ask me like what kind of splits should you do? And honestly that the answer to that is this is different for everybody It's whatever you can stick to for me when I started lifting I mainly did the bro split and that was like all I did it was just you, you did one muscle group a day a bunch of volume for it and you didn't you only hit like each muscle group once a week now i try to hit, hit each muscle group like twice a week but really again it's what you have the most fun with um i think it's good to switch it up too so i've been doing like push pull legs and like arnold splits for a while so i think switching to the bro split might be kind of fun just to switch things up um but yeah just doing so much delt front delt stuff it was i just wasn't used to this at all but it really was a good workout and he had little cues that he would make us do little supersets here and there that would just kind of take the intensity to the to the next level just again getting past that you know the breaking through that barrier of doing like three sets of eight to 12 like getting past that mindset and like switching things up and actually going from like a a bodybuilding standing point where you're trying to sculpt the physique rather than just you know push weight up and down um which is dope because the twins just like dropped the video on how they're getting into bodybuilding now so for them this is a, a way different type of training um which is really cool because this is the way i really like enjoy training and they're more of like the you know meathead like really heavyweight you know bench squat deadlift type of people and now they're going to be bodybuilding they're going to be doing more you know bodybuilding stuff focused which is what i love doing so we'll be working out a lot more um yeah so he's got us doing basically we knocked out our front delt burnt that up did some lateral raises did some uh smith machine shoulder press which i prefer over dumbbell presses just because i feel more secure in my uh my torn labrum do we hit rear delts on the uh, reverse fly pec deck? I usually never do these, but um, honestly, it felt pretty good. I feel like my rear delts um, are a really strong point for me, even though I rarely ever train them directly. And then we got some posing done. Um, definitely getting a little bit leaner. Uh, I think I weighed 176 pounds at night. I'm pretty sure it's because I was sick. I had like a digestive system like sickness, so I wasn't able to eat. So I lost some weight and I'm looking a little bit flat. Um, so I'm just going to eat a little bit more the next few days. But the goal is to get back down to 170 pounds and that's when I'll be like summer ready um, for content this year. But that's pretty much it for the workout. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Now we're going to get into the rest of the video. So Chris here is in trouble because he shot my man's Kyle in the face and almost took his eye out last night. I'll have to pop up some clips and show you guys what happened. But <laughs> Yo, get off my home, boy. <laughs> Yo, Chandler, why are you trying to charge me? Say sorry. Sorry. Say 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 Chris really just shot me in my face. Yo, you know. shot an unarmed person, bro? You I know was, it's a crime? It's actually, I shot the wall and it bounced off. I was holding a white flag. That's actually, what I worse. shot the door just warning shots. Cause You're a war criminal, bro. I shot the door. They it's like it's a Geneva shot. Convention, you know that? What is that, Alex? <laughs> you don't know what that is? <laughs> no. That's crazy you don't know that. Alex, bro, I got a lightsaber right now, so... Yo tried to use Nugget as defense when I went to go shoot him with the airsoft gun, which is crazy. Nugget, what you think about that? Let him know. If I grabbed Abby, that's a different story. Maybe you would have shot. <laughs> that's true, too, though. He would. He'd shoot me over Nugget. Yeah. Let's get out of here.
All right, we're about to go get. We're about to go tan and then do some extra cardio since we trained so early. I'm so tired, bro. I'm lethargic. The boys leave tomorrow, um, really early. They're going to LA for like a week, and then the day they get back, we have to move into the new house. So that's when I'll do like a house tour. I'm gonna have to pack up this week. I'm so excited for that. I want to make that office look like super dope. I'm gonna have to like figure out how I want to decorate it, but I'm excited. All right, we're back from cardio. Chris is about to go shove up some pork chops. Cute bite size yeah. pork chops. Yep, and then Abby's gonna make I think, acai, bowls. acai bowls. Chef Shiesty, that'd be, that'd be the one. <laughs> Chef Shiesty is the one. That's it for the video. You guys ran up the Elysium drop today. I appreciate it as always. Thank you guys so much for supporting. We have some cool. I want to show you guys. Actually, no, I shouldn't show you guys yet. We have some cool shit coming. That's all I'm gonna say. Like, we have some really dope. Like, I'm so excited. We have like a Greek god drop, a Spartan drop. Uh, we have a lot of cool stuff in the works, and luckily we should have compressions possibly in the next drop if the sample we get on Friday is good and working on shorts and a bunch of other stuff with the. We're trying to make a lot of things like USA made, like American made, American printed, and all that. So we're trying to get that done over the next few weeks. Um, but yeah, again, love you guys. Code Alex on Raw Gear, Alpha Line, Flex Pro, and Celsius. Till next time.